promise to be made in this image. So you have a purpose. You know, I'm living my dream. I have my wife and my three children out there. You know, my dream is doing what I'm doing right now. What is your dream? Some people say, well, I'm too old. Well, look at Colonel Sanders. Mm. He, didn't get, he didn't get started he was a senior citizen. That's right. He got the social security check one day and said, you know what? Let me start working with this chicken breast. <laughs> 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 I sat on it for a while, but wait a minute, that's not he got in his car and started driving. Uh, I think all of us are in this chicken right here today. The second is what? Vision. First is purpose, second is vision. The way you see yourself. I like what Susan Taylor says, the way you see yourself is how you're gonna come out in life. How do you see yourself? I, I like to say it this way. See yourself through the lens of God's eyesight. People say, well, I'm this height. I'm this size, I'm this. You know what? God says you're a winner. Right. You're valuable. You know, it's amazing when social media people take, uh, you can tell how people don't value yourself. You're just as important as anyone else. Now, someone to take a picture with a celebrity and they'll say, what? Look at this celebrity. Well, if I take a picture with him, I say, what? Look at me. Right. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> LeBron James gets a chance to take a picture with me. Uh -huh. But a lot of people say, is that arrogance? No, because I'm what? Man in God's image, and I have a vision for myself. All right, all right. And it's amazing to have that vision, you know, because we think in pictures. You know, how do you see yourself? And I tell the kids, I do a lot of motivational speaking and anti-bullying in the schools, and I tell the kids, how you see yourself is how others will see you. And if you just have a picture of yourself, and I want to share something with you that's interesting. I call it my dream book. You know, it's amazing. That whatever you put in your book, you know, that's pictures of me. I, mean, I can't show sure everyone, but there's a picture of me with a Mercedes. Here's another one with a private jet. Now, you say, well, why do you want these type of things? Well, I look at it this way. In this life, you only have one shot. All right. <laughs> Hello? This is no dress rehearsal. Now, when the young man did the praise with dancing, I'm sure he practiced and made a mistake. But in life, you know, he had what? Dress rehearsal. When they had to play at the Twinsburg School, it was what? Dress rehearsals. So they could kind of fix that a little bit before you had the what? The encore performance. In this life, there are no dress rehearsals. This is it. So you might as well dream. Someone looked to your neighbor and said, I am a dreamer. I am a dreamer. There's nothing too hard for God to do. The third thing is action. So he told the children of Israel, you know what action is? Someone said it earlier, go. That's it. Go and do. A moving car is better than a parked car. And, uh, and sometimes people are spiritual and say, you know what? Well, I prayed and fasted for this, and I prayed and fasted for this job. OK, that's good. But Monday morning, you shouldn't go. <laughs> With some what? Action. And as you move. It's amazing, when you move, God moves with you. African Americans, as we celebrate uh, African American or black history, God has moved with what? Moved with us. He's moved with this nation, with all people. So I like to really look at it this way, we're all one. Don't you agree? Yes. We're all valuable. Yes. Now, this is just the color of my skin. But really, I'm made in this image. Actually, the value is not placed on the color of the skin. It's placed by who? The manufacturer. So if I go to the Mercedes dealer and say, I want the S600, and it costs $110,000, they are going to make it in what? Different colors. They have a silver one, they have a black one, and they have a white one. Sir, which one do you want? I want the white one. Can I get a discount? No. Still $110,000. I want the silver one. Do I get a discount? What? No, it's still what? I've been ten thousand dollars. I want a brown one. Do I get a discount? No. Why? Because it's what? Still a hundred what? Ten thousand dollars. Because the value is not placed on the color. It's placed on who? The, the car and the manufacturer that made the car. So give God a hand clap of praise because He's made it.